Welcome back to Energy Motor Cars. Today, I've got this absolutely beautiful 2015 Corvette Z06. This car has a Z07 package in this awesome Laguna Blue. Uh, black interior, it's a 3LZ, seven-speed manual convertible. This thing checked almost every box. Um, almost a completely fully loaded car. The only thing it's missing, I think, are like competition seats and then maybe like a couple of carbon accessories. But uh, just a gorgeous Laguna Blue Z06 with the Z07 package, convertible, manual transmission. Uh, and this car has 4,800 miles on it. It's a one owner car. So guys, this is the one. This, is, this car is just, I can't stop staring at it when I'm here at my shop. I cannot stop staring at how gorgeous this car is. And I don't even think the video does it justice. You got to see this thing in person. It is just an absolutely beautiful car. So I will do a full walk around video of it. Uh, we'll go inside and out, fire it up. It's gonna be loud. Uh, car is completely stock as far as I can tell. Um, but yeah, one owner car with 4,800 miles on it. $105,000 original MSRP. And um, just beautiful. 3LZ, so it has everything wrapped in leather. It's got the suede inserts. Uh, and so, yeah, we'll just kind of go inside and out this thing. Starting off with the exterior, it has the Stage 3 Aero. So the Stage 3 Aero, you get the larger rear spoiler with the center, gosh, I don't know what it's called, but uh, just that center clear piece in there. You get the extended side skirts. Um, I had a 2LZ Z06 in here a couple of weeks ago that I just sold. The side skirts don't actually go all the way to the back wheel. They stop uh, about three quarters down the way of the door. And then you get the big uh, aggressive front splitter with the little canards on the side. Now this car actually has the um, smaller end caps on the side as well. It came with them. I'll show it to you whenever I pop the trunk. Um, so you kind of have the option. Now the, the stage three arrow in this car is done in carbon flash. So it's that um, metallic black that GM does. So all the arrow is, uh, is in this metallic black. Now what I like about that is it matches the um, little vents on the hood. It matches the uh, emblems on the side, the vent on the side, um, that brake duct back there, the spoiler is carbon flash and then um, your taillights are carbon flash, and then of course your whole uh, bottom half of the rear bumper is carbon flash. So everything matches, which is nice. I like the carbon fiber as well. Uh, what I don't like about the carbon fiber is that it doesn't match. You get a carbon fiber front splitter and side skirts, but then everything else is still carbon flash. So I think uh, by doing all the aero and carbon flash, it's just more consistent. Uh, so the car looks, looks killer with the stage three aero. Uh, with the top down. Another thing that's carbon flash uh, behind the um, seats. Uh, so you can see that beautiful metallic black next to the beautiful metallic Laguna Blue. So that's uh, just, man, it is a sharp car. The Z06s have clear taillights. That's a quick way to tell if you're behind a Z06 or a Grand Sport is look at the taillights. The Grand Sport is red. Uh, the taillights are red lenses and the Z06 have clear lens. So uh, this car has the chrome wheels. Uh, now this car originally from new had silver wheels on it, but the previous owner put OEM General Motors chrome Z06 wheels on it. So these are factory wheels and then uh, Pilot Super Sports. The Z07 package comes with um, Michelin Pilot Sport Cup 2s, which are ultra aggressive. They're very sticky. It's a great track tire. It is not a great street tire because they wear out so quickly. So it's not uncommon to see these cars with Pilot Super Sports or some other tire on them that's a little bit more street friendly. So that's what this car has. It has the chrome wheels uh, with the Pilot Super Sports. Uh, I think these tires only have maybe 2,000 miles on them. They're in fantastic shape. Uh, they're only a few years old. So that is pretty much the exterior on the car. I'll pop the hood and, and then pop the trunk and we'll go kind of inside and out. But um, but going into the car, uh, I mentioned this car, let it stop dinging here, which it should. Um, I mentioned it is a 3LZ, 
So the 3LZ has uh, essentially everything wrapped in leather. So there's a lot more leather on the door panels. The entire dash is wrapped in leather. And then the quality of the leather, leather is actually different than a 2LZ. And then if you can see, the seat inserts uh, are this micro suede. So uh, you get this nice two-tone kind of suede plus uh, leather interior. And then there is that manual, beautiful seven-speed manual transmission. Three billet pedals making this car so much fun to drive, especially with the top down on a nice sunny day. Uh, everything wrapped in leather, just a really fun car. Heads up display, of course, it has PDR, which is that performance data recorder. Uh, you can see the little waterfall. Uh, I like how Corvettes do this when the top down. It kind of looks like, I mean, this car is meant to be driven with the top down, like the way they finish everything out, uh, the top hides. Um, you know, I'd want to have the top up as little as possible on this car, so. Yeah, this 3LZ interior is really nice. I was actually quite surprised. This is the first 3LZ car I've had. I had a 2LZ Z06, it was 2018, a couple of weeks ago, and thought the interior was great. And then I got in this 3LZ and I was like, man, this thing is plush with uh, all the, the um, additional leather and then the, just the different quality leather. I think it's maybe like a Napa leather compared to something else, I'm not real sure. But anyway, it does actually make a difference. Surprising, so there's your drive modes, of course. This car has uh, magnetic suspension. I'll go ahead and pop the rear where you get a little bit of storage and I've got like all the, uh, everything the car came with. <coughs> Excuse me. So it came with like your front license plate cover. Um, that's kind of a reproduction window sticker. It's not the factory Monroney sticker, but you can at least see all the factory options here. And the, as I mentioned, $105,000 MSRP. So this car was almost fully loaded. It has the foam pads to go around the carbon rotors, um, your wheel locks, uh, some of the random stuff. There are those carbon flash pieces that go on the end of the front splitter. So if you didn't like how aggressive this was, or if it got damaged or something, you can actually remove these here uh, where this line is and you put those smaller caps on. Um, so that's an option. And it does not look like they've ever been used. So they are there. And then you can just see you get a little bit of storage. You have a little compartment over there, a little net, um, speakers in the back, factory speakers. So yeah, there's a little bit of room, not a ton, but you get some storage in the back. And then I will go ahead and pop the hood and show you the heart of this beast. So there is your 6.2 liter supercharged LT4 making 650 horsepower and 650 foot-pounds of torque. Big Z06 Corvette flags underneath there. While I'm over here, I'll show you these massive carbon rotors uh, with the red calipers. So these things, you step on the brake pedal on this car hard enough, you're probably gonna go through the windshield because it will stop. And the benefit of carbon rotors, one of the benefits of carbon rotor, rotors is that they don't fade like a steel rotor does. Um, but guys, what a beautiful, beautiful car. Turns a lot of heads in this color. So I'll go ahead and fire it up and uh, it's gonna be a loud one. Listen to it run, uh, 4,800 miles on it. I believe it was 4,823 if I saw that right. One owner car, clean Carfax, no accident history. So don't expect anything wrong with this one. A uh, couple of little flaws on the outside, cosmetically very, very minor, uh, but it's not 100% perfect. I uh, just want to be transparent about that. Uh, it's very, very close, but not 100% perfect. I just had the dealer change the oil in this car, so it's got fresh mobile one in it, ready for the new owner. I'm gonna be sad to see this one go because uh, it just came off the truck the other day, the transporter, and man, it's gorgeous. So I'll go ahead and fire it up.
you probably know if you're watching the video, these have a tri-mode exhaust. Um, you actually get three different modes. You have um, probably what, tour, sport, and track on the exhaust where you can open up the valves in different levels and um, you know, kind of change the, the tone of the exhaust, whether you want it to be quiet or loud. And uh, this thing screams with the valves open, but then it's nice and quiet with them closed. So it's really cool. I'm gonna go ahead and shut it off just so I don't leave it running inside the shop. But I do like to start all these cars and just kind of show everybody, make sure you know that the temperatures are good. Um, there's no check engine light. There's no service lights on. You know, these cars have this cool screen that uh, hides away. So if you wanted to keep anything back there, you can, but yeah, I'll go ahead and just shut the car off. The three LZ, the two LZ and three LZ come with your heated and cooled seats, which is awesome. I mean, how many cars out there? I know there are a few, but how many cars out there have 650 horsepower and heated and cooled seats? The cool thing about this, you get a manual transmission with all that. I mean, what a car. So there it is. There's the walk around of the beast. Uh, I'm gonna put this car live on the website either today or tomorrow. Uh, today is October 24th, 2021. So this car should be live here pretty soon. And then in the description below, I'll have a link to uh, my website, which has a write-up. It has, I'll probably have 80 plus pictures of this car, something around there. And then it'll have the price as well as my contact information. My phone number here is 281-768-5290. Facebook and Instagram are both at Energy Motor Cars. The website is energymotorcars.com. Take a look. If you're interested in this car, shoot me an email. Give me a call. I'll be happy to sell it to you. Thank you for watching.